Hello everyone, I'm Hardman Kananda and I can speak with my telepathic powers because of my mustache. I will show you how to install the internal SSD for the PlayStation 5. The first step is to buy a compatible PS5 SSD. The one I brought is the Western Digital SN850 NVMe SSD with the heatsink version. I strongly recommend you to use an SSD that has a heatsink, or else it can melt and it will it can damage your PlayStation 5. The second step is to make sure that your PlayStation 5 is up to date. The PS5 only has 667 GB of internal storage. For, for step 3, you unplug the console and position the console so that the PS PlayStation logo is face down. After that, you will need to remove the cover. You hold the two corners in a diagonal way and lift the upper right corner while sliding the lower left corner. Doing this can be a little hard. After that you use a screwdriver to unscrew the main screw. After that you will unscrew the secondary screw. Be careful not to use it. After that, you will carefully insert the SSD. After that, you will stabilize the SSD with a secondary screw. Once you are done, you can reattach all the covers. Step number 4. When you boot the PlayStation 5, you will need to format the SSD. Now we have a lot of space to install our games. I tested a lot of games on my new SSD. PlayStation 4 games worked very well. I tested Sonic Mania. I also tested PS5 games like Sackboy. And the loading time is still fast. I also brought the limited edition of Tales of Arise for the PlayStation 5. I waited to receive my PS5 SSD before installing the game because I had no more space. Now I have enough space to install all of my games. This makes my life easier. The, the game of Tales of Arise works very well. Bye everyone, I love you all because of my mustache. Soon I will post my video about my top 5 favorite Disney and Ghibli movies. See you soon.